Humber stands to be the home of an exciting world's first as a group of students are working on a project that is out of this world. Four final year radio and wireless telecommunications students are putting the final touches on an antenna meant to contact the International Space Station as their final project. Their instructor, Mark Rector, says he was surprised when they presented the idea. It's kind of akin to your eight-year-old coming home and saying they wanted to try out for the Pittsburgh Penguins. It's a pretty massive project, which is, you'd almost say, beyond their skill level at this point. And With such a massive project, the students are even surprising themselves. Like myself and Paul, for instance, uh, we don't have much of a telecommunications background. And to say that we came into this with nothing, and now we're undertaking this project that's, you know, for all intents and purposes, it's huge. Like, it, it's a really big deal. It's, it's a little mind-blowing. The group says once they're finished, they will still need approval from NASA. A representative will come to check their work and make sure the antenna meets NASA specifications. The antenna is over a year in the making and has cost $3,000 so far. In order to contact the space station, the group will be required to build a backup antenna as well. The students say they decided to take on the project because they wanted to do something special. What we thought of for our final project is to do something that stands out above the rest of the colleges and something that will actually make our program stand out within our college. When the group does make contact with the station, they will be the first college students in the world to do so. They will also have the opportunity to speak to an astronaut on board the station for 10 minutes. The group plans to have a contest to allow Humber students to suggest some questions of their own. So when will the antenna be completed? Soon. <laughs> we're hoping. Uh, within the next month or two, we're hoping to have everything operational and tested. So can these students really do what they propose? Mark Rector says yes. They're, they're surprising me every day with their abilities and how well they're pulling this off. So uh, I have absolute full confidence. There's no question they'll do this. Until then, the students will continue working hard and keeping an ear to the sky. I'm Jeff Wimbush for The Daily Planet. Yeah.